morning, Southeast Texas. Our gospel today is a familiar gospel to many of us. I think probably the first time I became very cognizant of it, uh, obviously going to church, but beyond that, outside of the walls of the church, often at baseball games when I was a kid, you'd see a gentleman with a colored wig on, and he would stand up behind home plate, and he'd hold up a big sign, and it would say, John 316, and he'd show up at football games, and became a thing. I think they still, you'll still see people hold up that sign. Why? Because this good man, these good people who hold up these signs, want people to know this, the words of John 316, God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, so that everyone who believes in him might not perish, but might have eternal life. Every line of that verse is so beautiful. God so loved the world. God so loves us that he sent us his son, that we who believe in him might not perish, but might have eternal life. My brothers and sisters, that's the good news. We are loved and we have a God who wants us to be with him forever. Thank you.